Hey guys, this is Ranjan Ranganathan back with 5W series. Life is going smooth for all of us, thanks to technology which made many things seamless. And in today's world, technology is developing at an unprecedented rate. The latest gadget today is tomorrow's antique. <laughs> As a result of this rapid development of technology, we often take things for granted. Then something popped up in my mind. What could be the greatest inventions of mankind that changed our lives tremendously? Some that pop into my mind are the invention of cooking food, like burgers, pizzas, curries, pickles, etc. Making of clothes, construction of houses, etc. And then comes one thing which made our lives simpler and faster and reduced the effort. And that is the invention of the wheel, without which our lives could have been very much restricted to small geographic regions. Unless, of course, you're a travel enthusiast who prefers walking across the globe. So, who invented the wheel? Though we can't assign it to one person, we will share how it came into use. Hey, one thing I thought of, if someone had patented this, he could have been the richest person in the world, as everyone needs it all the time. Thank God patenting was not there then. Take a look around and you will see wheels everywhere, be it as tires or in everyday machinery. The wheel has even been imbued with an, a symbolic meaning, most famously perhaps as a metaphor for the never-ending cycle of life. One may be tempted to think that the wheel is just a humble or even primitive invention compared to some of the fancy gadgets that we have today. Nope. Nevertheless, the wheel specifically as a means of transportation, was actually invented at a relatively late point of human history. The oldest known wheel found in an archaeological excavation is from Mesopotamia and dates to around 3500 BC. This period was known as the Bronze Age, which is a relatively late chapter in the story of the development of human civilization. By this time, human beings were already planting crops, herding domesticated animals, and had some form of social hierarchy. One of the reasons why the wheel was invented only at this point in history is due to the fact that metal tools were needed to chisel fine-fitted holes and axles. This leads to the next reason. The wheel was not just a cylinder rolling on its edge. It was a cylinder that was connected to a stable stationary platform. This wheel axle concept was a stroke of genius, but making it was a challenge. The ends of the axle, as well as the holes in the center of the wheels, had to be nearly perfectly smooth and brown. Failing to achieve this would result in too much friction between these components and the wheel would not turn. Although the axle had to fit snugly in the holes of the wheels, they had to have enough room to allow them to rotate freely. Given the complexity of the wheel-axle combination, it may be unsurprising that the wheel was not initially invented for transportation purposes. Instead, it has been claimed that wheels were first used by potters. Remember the 5,500 year old wheel of Mesopotamia? It seems that it was a potter's wheel. The use of wheels for pottery making may date even further back into the Neolithic age. It seems that the use of wheels for transportation only happened 300 years later. 
Although the world's oldest wheel has been found in Mesopotamia, the, the earliest images of wheeled carts were found in Poland and elsewhere in the Eurasian steppes. Some have suggested that due to the immense challenge that the invention, uh, invention of the wheel posed to mankind, it probably happened only once and spread from its place of origin to other parts of the world. However, others believe it developed independently in separate parts of the world at around the same time. At present, the birthplace of the wheel is said to be either in Mesopotamia or the Eurasian steppes. Although Mesopotamia has the oldest known wheel, linguistic evidence is used to support the claim that the wheel originated in the Eurasian steppes. Although the wheel has revolutionized the way early human beings traveled and transported goods from one place to another, the wheel was not a perfect invention. For instance, camels were a much more efficient form of transportation in the desert environment when compared to the wheel. It has also been claimed that between the 2nd and 6th centuries AD, the camel supplanted the wheel as the primary mode of transport in the Middle East and North Africa. Nevertheless, the wheel was still used for domestic purposes such as for irrigation, milling and pottery making. This shows the various uses of the wheel and its importance to mankind. I guess we ought to change our perspective about the wheel and not view it as a basic invention by primitive man. Instead, we should view it as one of the greatest achievements of human society. Can you imagine cars or most of the other transportation vehicles without wheels? The wheel and axle technology? Obviously, the answer is no. So is the food technology. Time for food, and I always declare gratitude to those who invented food making and processing. <laughs> Finally, I would say the greatest inventions in the ancient ages are the foundations for the modern technology. So, explore more about them. See you. Subscribe now to know more about such interesting facts. Thank you.